Hi, we just want to give a quick overview today of the Mach Motion 1000 series turn control. To start off, um, we have a locked and unlocked DRO screen up here in the top right. So in this lock screen, these fixture offsets cannot be changed. Um, but here on the locked screen, you can manually change the offset. You can also click 0Z. We also have tool information right here feed rate display and override and then spindle display and override down here in the bottom right we have machine uh, function buttons so mist coolant some auxiliary buttons the user can set up we also have spindle buttons to manually turn the spindle on and off down here in the bottom portion we have a g-code tab to load and edit and close g-code files an advanced tab with some advanced run options and toolpath limits we also have an MDI tab that you can manually enter in a line of G code. Uh, let's add another one here. Make it Z. We'll go to two. Oops. Let's try Z. <laughs> one last time. Here we go. Um, we also have an on screen jogging available. Here. And then, of course, machine control, uh, cycle control button, cycle start, stop, reset, and disable and enable for the system. Um, last but not least, we do have a toolpath display up here that will show the toolpath when a program's loaded, and our mock motion can cycles. So, this is something we've um, built and generated. We will have further videos to really show how to use these and how they work. But today, I just have an example of a couple turn cycles for an OD and an ID. Um, but if I post this program, we'll see the toolpath now. I can go back to the G code tab and we'll see the G code generator right here. Um, but we can easily set up. I kind of see the axes on there. But if I zero right there and zero the Z just a little bit off, we can modify that. Um, I can like regenerate the toolpath and so on. But we're ready to hit cycle start. We can see the machine axis indicator move around as it's going through the tool paths. And that concludes the program. Again, this is just a quick demo of our control. We'll have future videos come out that would further explain tool setup and, of course, the mock motion can cycles, among other things. Thanks.